Hey, hey, peeps, what's up? This is Demetrius Moppins, a.k.a. Michi, and welcome to another edition of the R&B Old School LP Album Review. It's been a couple months since I last did a show, and had some things going on, but everything's been taken care of now. Also, I want to direct your attention to our new, uh, to my new logo here. Hope you like the new logo of the R&B Old School LP Album Review. That's going to be the logo from now on. Alright, now, our album for this episode that I'm going to be reviewing for you. It's a 1979 album from the NMCA record label. Now, before we get to the name, let me get to this cover here. Okay, put this over here. Now, right here, John Robinson. He is on drums and percussion. We got Tony Maiden, guitar and vocals. Right here, let me go down here first. Bobby Watson on bass. David Hawk. Walensky, keyboards, Kevin Murphy, also on keyboards, and the great Shaka Khan there. And this is the album, which released on October 12, 1979, Master Jam. And it's produced by the great Quincy Jones, one of the best record producers not only in R&B music but in uh, worldwide music ever. And this album was a success because of him. Now let me go over some of the let me go over some of the songs on here. There are nine uh, Heaven Bound Walk the Rockway Living Me Body Heat and What Am I Missing? Now, Master Jam, the title of the song and also the album, was, uh, was one of the songs that did not, on this album, that did not get charted. Now, this, there, there is a video on it of Master Jam. And it's on YouTube somewhere along with one other song from this album, which I'm going to get to in just a second. Master Jam. At the beginning, you get the guitar, the bass, the guitars, jamming. Try air it. And this, um, and this song did not get as much radio airplay than the other song, other three popular songs on there. But it is a great, great song to dance to. Now, there were two songs that were charted in 1980. Any Love and I'm Dancing for Your Love. Now, Any Love R&B Billboard Charts at number 24. I'm Dancing for Your Love, number 43 at the River and Blues Billboard Charts. Now, both songs still get that disco beat. Still get that funky soul sound of the late 70s. And this is set, this, these two are probably one of the best, not the best, but the, the good songs on this album. And I got both of them on 
I to I uh, on my iPod and um, I don't listen to it as much, but I li try to listen to them at least once per week. Especially any love, a good song to dance to. Now, do you love what you feel? 1979, number one on the Billboard R&B charts, number 30 on the pop charts. And this is another video to it. There is another video for the, for the Master Jam album. There is another video from the Master Jam album featuring the entire band and also on a white background on a white floor. Now this song did get more airplay back in late 1979, early 1980, even on the radio and also also is played frequent, frequently on the Soul Train show. Now, feel a song where you go out to the go out to the clubs, get your groove on, and people were dancing to this song. Dancing, dancing, dancing to the song. And because of this album, or I should say this song, this album reached number one to top the charts in 1979. Three other albums that Rufus and Shaka Khan top the charts. Rufus featuring Shaka Khan in 1975, Ask Rufus in 1977, and Street Player back in 78. Now on the US R&B charts, 14, pretty damn high. But because of Do You Love What You Feel, the top single, one of the top singles of 1979, Master Jam, Any Love, and I'm Dancing for Your Love, and all the others. Quincy Jones has produced a masterpiece. This probably one of Quincy Jones's best work. And um, this is why. The number one R&B album of 1979. Now, so there you have it. Our Rufus and Shaka Khan Master Jam 1979 on the MCA record label. And that is going to wrap it up for this week's edition of the R&B Old School LP Album Review. Now, next time out, I'm going to be reviewing Give Me the Night, which is a pop popular song in one of the top albums from 1980. And, uh, of, and also of a couple of uh, good songs on there too so be looking out for it next week until then I'm Michi I'll see you next time on the R&B Old School LP album review ciao baby